I'm gonna journey back to the house. Shoot, if I had more time, I would, I would be more than happy to enjoy ride around a little bit more. But gotta make my way in. I'm not. Uh, I'm actually. I'm not commuting much anymore. Last week, I got about three days of commuting in, but the nights were. The nights were in the 50s, so it was a little bit easier to commute. The heated grips, the heated grips worked wonderful. And they helped keep my hands warm. I remember when we were looking for houses, they showed us a house back here somewhere. A little further back, a little further back that way. On the other side, actually, I would have had to made a left had to make a left further back but uh yeah you really don't realize how weird house layouts are until you start looking for a house and you start seeing how people do certain things with houses and and make certain mods and changes and some of them are just really hard to understand as to why they did them you know Saturday so everybody's gonna want to have a little little yard sale going on and a lot of times a lot of these things changes that people make it's hard to understand why they do them I mean, there were some houses that we went to that you had to walk through the living room to get to another bedroom but on the other side of the living room there was a bedroom so it was like it was just weird you know, as opposed to all of the bedrooms being on one side of the house and living room, dining room, kitchen on the other side of the house. You know, it's, it's, you could tell it was an afterthought. You could tell it was something that they thought off after the fact and then decided that they would, uh, oh, well, let's do this addition or add something on. So. So we are, we found, we did go into contract with the contractor to do the roof. And I was going to do three windows, but then I ended up changing it. And I said, you know what, let's do six windows. Because I would end up covering all of the windows on the bedroom side. And I figured, you know what, he's in there. So why not just have him go ahead and change all of those windows. And, you know, they're a little older, you know, they are approaching probably in that 26, 27 year old phase. So, you know, they, they definitely are a bit older. So, yeah. So I figured I may as well do that. I may as well, uh, Get that done. Why? Well, it made the most sense to do. So, <laughs> and it's like you know what? You got them there one time. You may as well just change those, those three, those six. Change out all six of them. That will cover that whole side of the house. And then later on, when I'm ready, um, I can update the bay window. We have a bay window that I would like to update. Now here's the kicker. That and it kind of pissed me off. You know, and I was a little, I was a little taken back with this. You know, Blues Rider works over here. Yeah. Hey, Blues Rider! What's going on, baby? <laughs> hey, he's over here somewhere. Yeah, so I was, you know, I was a little, uh, I was a little teed off about this. And it's, it's, it's something that you you have to go through 
with being a homeowner and it's you know you have to get permits to get certain things done and I don't know maybe it's me but I just think it's stupid that you go through all of the things that you go through to own a home and be a homeowner right but then to make any changes you have to get a freaking permit it's like what the frick I don't know I just think it's stupid you know it's like you really don't own your home <laughs> when I moved into the house right the previous owner I guess he never told the, he never told the town that he put in these two sheds there's two sheds they're in the back of the house the back of my house is woods like this over here right so there's really there's no one behind me to for them to disturb there's no one behind me that's gonna wake up in the morning and look at these two sheds first thing they see when they look out their window right so town calls me in and they're like hey we have to raise your taxes because you have those two sheds back there and we need to raise your taxes it was like a hundred bucks or whatever it was I don't remember so I was like wait a minute why I said why are you raising why would you need to raise my taxes and they said oh well you know there has to be a certain a certain setback and they have to they have to sit back a certain amount and you know they have to be raised up a certain amount. I was like dude I'm calling bull crappy you know we're gonna kind of keep it clean but I was like I'm calling bull crap you know because I just don't believe I, it's, it's money that's what it is it's all about money and that's what these that's what these town associations are about it's all about money so anyway so yeah, so I gotta get a permit for this roof, to get this work done on the roof. A permit from the town. I gotta get a permit from them to make a modification, not even a modification, a change and improvement to my house. Insane. Insane. In my opinion anyway, I don't know. That's what I, that's how I feel. Obviously, I know they're not gonna feel that way, but they feel that yes you should have to get a permit because they want to be able to tell you they want to be able to tell you that you have to make the changes that they want you to make and that's it they don't want you making changes that they don't know about because they feel that they should know about them and I just say bullshit man I don't, damn, I didn't mean to curse. But, uh, you know, it's it's just, it's, it's a little bit annoying. And then if you really get into, you know, certain things, all right, certain things like uh, expanding a window. Now, that I that I get, that I understand. You know, you know you're, you're, you're kind of making a, a huge change. Uh, that's a little different. You know that's a, that's that's something I could understand that. You know you're making a huge change. You're talking about uh, just watching this exit here for anything that looks different than dry pavement, like diesel fuel. Jeez. Yeah, so something like that I can understand. You know, and I get it. That that I get. You know, and I understand. But still. Anyway, uh, you know what? That's my rant. That's my long video of the year. <laughs> but, so we're getting those changes done. Um, it's costing a decent amount of money. And then after that, the next change we have to do is we have to address our steps. And I'll talk more about that in another video. Uh, maybe uh, maybe this this week coming up we'll chat about that so by the way this was recorded on the GoPro Hero 8 and I hope you guys enjoyed the video however 
much of it you may watch or whatever part you decided to comment on. And remember, you can find me on Facebook at the best one is ride underscore ride. I'll put a picture so you can see it. You can also find me on Instagram, same name, the best one is ride. So you can follow me where I post my IG photos and other things. And it's also just another way to communicate with me if so need be. All right, you guys, it's your best one out. I thank you guys for watching. Thank you guys for following. Thank you guys for commenting and all of that good stuff. So take it easy now. Bye-bye.